Oh, hey y'all, welcome to my open diary session. I just completed an entry. Check it out. Hey y'all. So do y'all remember when Next Tail came with the chirp? So for my new babies, the Next Tail chirp was also a walkie talkie, a long distance walkie talkie. So you didn't have to be like super close. It made it to where you can, you know, chirp whomever is in your contact as opposed to calling them so when you chirp them it literally automatically come over loudspeaker so at the time i was in a relationship with my girl's father and you know i thought i was doing it big i had the next tail chirp we had matching chirps <laughs> they were yellow and black like i just knew i was doing it big right anyway y'all i was on break in the lunchroom honey and i was talking to the ex well my girl's father and um we were on the phone. I didn't even know how the chirping started. But anyway, he chirped over and his voice came over the loudspeaker. Girl. Oh, goodness, y'all. Why did this chick from the other side of the room look up? <laughs> so he has a very distinctive voice and it carries. <laughs> and it's already over a walkie-talkie. So it's loud. She was like, is that beep? child i was so embarrassed <laughs> then it was this one time we was in a club so whenever we stepped out we both tourists and we both like to dress whenever we stepped out we looked fucking good so it was an all-white party and let me just say i was looking good <laughs> anyway he walks off while we're at the club he you know ended up wherever across the, he wasn't even far from me so it, it was really no care i look up He's literally bent over whispering in this girl's ear. So I'm like, what the fuck? Like, are you serious? And then when my family got there, you know, he tried to make like I was just showing out because they were there. No, we've been discussing this shit. Y'all, he made me look like, a no, no, no. I take that back. I made myself look like a fucking fool dealing with that man. I had no self-worth. I had no self-love. But I will say I don't regret any of it. I had fun and I learned a ton of fucking lessons and thought I was ready to move on in life. And then the universe was like, okay, let's, let's test that. And I was introduced to the narcissistic psychotic ex. Up until then, everything else was literally fucking child's play. But I thank him because he is literally the sole reason I was plunged into healing, the reason I am who I am today, why I'm able to help others. Thank you. <laughs>